Welcome to Call Outs on Karachi. What's going on everyone? My name is Elias. I've been a full-time Call of Duty coach for the last two years. And if you want more content like this, check out my Discord in the description below. All right, let's start out with what's right in front of us. This entire building right here is called Top Market. Obviously right under it, it would be considered Bottom Market. And then over in that corner, some people would consider that chickens. And then in the other corner, you would call that Back Market. Uh, but mostly you can just consider that entire outside chickens. Where we're standing right now is called top third and right next to us could be called top second or I hear a lot of people call it top AC. And directly under us, this is a very important call out right here. That is gonna be called wood because a lot of people camp there and it is a beautiful hop up spot to get to top second and top third. Right here will be B site or BS and D. And then you go under the bridge towards back bridge stairs up towards clock, and then of course you have front clock stairs. This entire street right here is called B Street, and that right there would be called Sandbags or Barrels. And right here is B Street Alley into Mid, and you can just call this Middle, or some people call it P1 since this is the first hard point. All right, now looking behind us, all of this can be considered Top Clothes or Top Third. I also like to call it Top Laundry because right under us will be Bottom Laundry or Bottom Clothes. As we push out of bottom laundry, this will be considered pillars right here. And then right here, this would be called P3, or I've heard store. Some other people call this a uh, cafe, but I think this one would be good just to call it P3 or store. Back there, usually you would just wanna call this spawn area. And over here towards the right is considered graveyard. As we run back, all of this would be considered courtyard. And then right over here, all of this is just called shacks. Maybe the more we play, people will specify shack one, shack two, shack three, or like double shacks or single shacks, something like that. Uh, but for now, we can just call this shacks. What's most important about here is just considering this is all back red right here. As we go under, all of this is called arches right here. And then as you enter in towards your right, all of this would be called terminal or bus station. You could call this elevator. I've also heard that this is called P5. And as we push out of P5, we are now at the A site. You could also just call this bus right here. And then of course, this is cafe right here. You would also specify that this is cafe back alley. And the new addition to this map right here is another back alley, but I would actually call this storage since it reminds me of storage units. This alley right here is usually considered dark alley. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap back from cafe towards top red right now. This right here would be considered top red window, which you can actually hop up into. This would be all top red. And then right over here, this will be top red balcony or just balcony. And then of course we have bottom red over here. And as we wrap back middle, you can consider this middle alley. And this right here will be top bed. You could call this fountain door right here, and this could also be called fountain ladder. I've also heard it being called vent ladder or AC ladder. I usually would say we can go with the old call out and this is normally called the vent. All right, so as we run through vent, we're going towards top dome over here. Back here is usually called spawn or water, but to be specific, this would be water building, and then this would be the spawn, and then over here, this would all just be water. And we are right back at B Street, and as we are here at B Street, this will be considered top shop. Down here would be bottom shop, and then once you get inside of here, this will be fountain, and then of course, if someone's camping, you can also call this top fountain. Over time, these callouts will develop and get better as more teams play the game and create their own callouts. But for now, I hope these help you, and please let me know if you guys have any questions. Thank you so much, and peace.